Hi, my name is Greg McKettrick. I'm a pharmacist with Stanley Specialty Pharmacy. Stanley Specialty Pharmacy specializes in the treatment of a wide variety of conditions, but many of our patients come to us suffering from erectile dysfunction. One treatment modality for erectile dysfunction is a mechanical device known as a vacuum pump. A vacuum pump has been used for a long time to assist men in the ability to achieve a full erection. Now, the vacuum pump can be used for a variety of reasons. Depending on what stage of erectile dysfunction the patient has, they may use the vacuum pump as part of a physical therapy treatment. The pump can be used also to actually have intercourse, in which case it is combined with a retention ring, which allows the user to maintain the erection during intercourse. The pump and the rings are both available at Stanley Specialty Pharmacy, as well as on our store website. Now please watch the following video for more information on the use of the vacuum pump. Here is a drawing of the inside of a flaccid penis. This is the corpora cavinosa, the penile arteries, the penile veins, the penile nerves. The corpora cavinosa is the spongy tissue that fills with blood as it flows through the penile arteries. When the brain gives a signal for an erection, the penile veins begin to close, trapping the blood in the corpora cavinosa. This is the penis in the tumescent stage. The corpora cavinosa is getting larger as it holds the blood trapped by the closing of the penile veins. This is the erect penis, the final stage of the erection process. The corpora cavinosa has enlarged and is pressing against the walls of the penile shaft, causing the erection. It is also helping to close the penile veins, totally trapping the blood in the penis. Impotence can be the result of the penile veins not closing properly and allowing the blood to escape. Vacuum therapy is an effective method for treating impotence. The Encore vacuum therapy system includes a body shield, vacuum pump, penile cylinder, constriction rings, and mounting cone. The penile cylinder features a special ring removal guide which helps prevent losing the erection when applying the constriction ring to the penis. Stand the penile cylinder on a flat surface with the tapered end facing up. Slide the ring removal sleeve onto the cylinder. Insert the mounting cone. Lightly lubricate the mounting cone. Stretch the constriction ring over the mounting cone and secure it to the end of the cylinder. Remove the mounting cone. Insert the pump head into the opposite end of the tube and make sure the pump is firmly sealed. Place the body shield over the penis and position it against your body. Insert the penis into the cylinder making sure to firmly press the cylinder against your body to ensure a good seal. Turn the pump to the on position. After a firm erection is achieved, reach down and turn the ring ejector sleeve and twist. The ring ejector will twist the ring off the cylinder and break the vacuum seal in one swift motion. Shown here, the VTU-1 manual pump is designed for use with two hands. After the erection is achieved, Remove the body shield before intercourse. After intercourse, remove the ring by grabbing both handles and gently stretching it out. Then push the ring over the head of the penis until it has been removed. Never wear the ring for more than 30 minutes at a time. You must wait 60 minutes before applying the ring again. I hope that video was helpful and answered most of your questions as far as the use of a vacuum pump. If you still have questions, please contact us at Stanley Specialty Pharmacy so that one of our pharmacists can better explain the use and answer any follow-up questions that you might have. And again, the vacuum pump is available at our pharmacy as well as on our website as are 
the retention rings. Thank you so much.